Have you ever wanted to make an emergency kit but don't exactly know what goes into one? Well, Sergeant Preppers has got you covered. Okay, first thing I would recommend is the basics that uh, most people should have is food and water. So you could store bottled water, usually something in that's uh, small bottles that's transportable. And then I would also say like a water filter system, something like this that's portable, it's very good. And then food, whatever food you'd normally eat is always a good idea. And then I also sell uh, MREs, which are meals ready to eat. These come with a heater, chemical heater, so you can have a hot meal. So that's uh, the basics. Then I would recommend something like a first aid kit and um, a flashlight, some way to um, cook your food if you brought regular food. So we have these little portable stoves you can cook a few meals on. And then I would say something like, um, you can't remember everything for your survival stuff. So these are very, very good little pocket survival books or the larger ones. Biggest mistakes. I would say not being prepared to be gone long enough and forgetting about the things that are, are very valuable to them, like their photographs and family heirlooms and things like that. So if you have advance notice, get those things together and take off. Like I know some friends of mine in the Fort McMurray fire that um, wiped out a third of the city up there. They had uh, less than 10 minutes and they lost everything because they didn't have anything prepared. So they just came out with the clothes on their back. So that can happen if you don't have something right by your door and ready. Sergeant Preppers is open 10 to 6, Monday to Saturday. For Castanet News, I'm Madison Earhart in Kelowna. Looking for a new ride? Click our auto mall in the yellow masthead for a huge selection of car dealers from throughout the valley. <laughs>